Have you ever found yourself tangled in the complexities of Unity scripting, wondering how to control the order of execution between scripts? It can be a real puzzle, right? If that's you, then you're in the right place. Today, we're diving into how to execute one script start method just before another's in Unity C Sharp. I totally get it. It can be incredibly frustrating when you need one script to run before another, but Unity's default execution order doesn't always cooperate. You're definitely not alone in this struggle. Many developers face this challenge. Here's the specific question we're addressing today. One user asked, is it possible to run the start method from one script just before the start method of another script? Can you choose the order of execution? If you've ever wondered the same, stick around as we explore this together. So, what's the deal with Unity's execution order? By default, Unity runs the start methods in the order the scripts are attached to the game objects. However, there are ways to manipulate this order to suit your needs. Let's break it down. And don't go anywhere. I've got a handy tip at the end that will help you manage script execution order like a pro. To execute the start method of one script before another in Unity, the user can utilize the script execution order settings. This allows for precise control over when each script start method is called. Next, the user should add the scripts they want to control. In the script execution order window, the user can drag and drop the scripts to set their execution order. Now the user should arrange the scripts in the desired order. The script that needs to run first should be placed above the other script in the list. Finally, the user can test the setup by running the Unity project. They should observe that the start method of the first script executes before the start method of the second script. Fun fact, did you know that the order of execution in Unity can significantly affect gameplay? Just like a well-choreographed dance, every move matters. Now let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative approach suggests that if script A needs to run after script B, you should have script B call script A directly. This way, script A can receive any necessary data from script B. This method can help avoid long debugging sessions, especially in larger projects where script execution order can lead to hidden dependencies and bugs. That's all on that answer. Let's take a look at another one. An alternative approach suggests that you can control the execution order of scripts by calling a function from the second script at the end of the first script start method. You can do this by referencing the second script and its function directly. This way, you can execute functions in any order you prefer. The user also mentions that they are new to programming, so they hope this helps. Here's the pro tip I promised. Always document your script execution order, especially in larger projects. This will save you time and headaches down the line. And there you have it. You now know how to control the execution order of your scripts in Unity. Remember, managing script execution is crucial for smooth gameplay. If you found this helpful, hit that subscribe button for more tips. And don't miss our next video where we tackle more Unity challenges.